and welcome to the nation's digital news with me, Wanapa Kaupa, and with today's top story. Prime Minister Apisit Veta Chiwa left Thailand on Wednesday for the United States to attend the 65th United Nations General Assembly in New York. Apisit planned to hold talks with American investors over the country's economic and political situation. The General Assembly will be participated by leaders of 192 countries, which is held with a meeting on the Millennium Development Goals or MDGs high on the agenda. In the MDGs meeting, heads of state will convene to speed up progress towards reaching the goals by the 2015 target date. The goals include reducing poverty, combating disease, fighting hunger, protecting the environment, and boosting education. A visit is also scheduled to meet American investors and business participants from the U.S. ASEAN Business Council Thursday afternoon to boost investor confidence and inform them about the kingdom's ongoing economic recovery. The Thai Premier said his September 22nd to 26th visits to the U.S. will be an opportunity to discuss with American political and business leaders regarding the situation in Thailand. Apisit said in quote, this, this will be a good opportunity to explain to them the Thai economic recovery and investment direction. There still are a large number of American investors who are deciding whether to launch or expand their investment in Thailand, end of quote. When asked how he will clarify the problem of Mataput Industrial Estate and the suspended 3G wireless service auction to the American investors, the Thai Premier said every party should follow the court's decision, but the government is also speeding up other related mechanisms to push the projects ahead. <coughs> Commenting on possible talks on border disputes with Cambodia, Prime Minister Hun Sen on the sideline of the UN meeting, Abisi said he is not sure if there will be enough time for both leaders to meet and the issue is completed. Abisit, however, pointed out that he and Hun Sen will have to meet again in several international forums in the next few months, and that relations between the two neighboring countries have been restored as ambassadors of both sides have resumed their duties. The Prime Minister said in quote, what can be confirmed now is that both countries will focus on solving problems with peaceful means as good neighbors and existing mechanism to function normally. The dispute should be raised in a bilateral talk without any help from other Southeast, uh, sorry, Southeast Asian nations in the court. That's all for now. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned with nationmultimedia.com for more news. Swadika.